Hi, welcome to Ogre Hamster. Today I'll be viewing this U-Moon Bluetooth speaker. And before I get to pros and cons, let me just first talk about the speaker a little bit. And what's different about this speaker, the model YM-868, are two things. One, it has a solar charging panel on the back over here for me to charge the battery. The built-in battery is about 1200 milliamps. And the charge rate for this is about 80 to 120. Uh, milliamps per hour that's what's advertised so essentially that would take about two days of being this being the sun on the construction side around, around the side over here it's all uh, like silicon so it is IPX4 slight drop proof water resistant type of usage and when it's charging there are actually two LEDs behind here um, the left one is a Bluetooth blue LED the right one if I flip it towards the sun the right one will illuminate I don't think my capture. I don't think my camera can capture it, but it's a red LED. It's not very bright. It just basically tells me that okay, it's, there's enough sun for for this unit to start charging. Now I pair this with my Android device. I can also pair with my uh, Apple device, iPod, iPad, iPhone. And what I found was that the speaker quality is okay. It's decent. It doesn't have a base. It's, not, it's, it's a 5 watt speaker. Also in the box it came with a micro USB cable for charging, auxiliary cable, and the user manual. Which is this one right here. So utilizing the Bluetooth uh, 3.0 I get about 6 hours of battery life. And I can also use this as a uh, speakerphone to make phone calls. And I can get well over 15 hours with that. So here I'm just play something. And I can just raise the volume. That's, a, that's the max volume possible. Also pause the music right now. And I can control what I want here. here. And there's a, one additional button, the M button. So with the M button, I can cycle between auxiliary, Bluetooth, or the micro SD card reader right here. So it can read 32 gigabyte micro SD card. That way I don't need to have it pair with my um, iPod, iPhone, Android phones, anything else. And once I put music on my micro, micro SD card, this is its own self-contained unit. Now, this this bar over here, it turns both ways. So if I want to, say, play music and have it charge, I can just angle it and just fa have it face the sun. On my smartphone, it does tell me how much charge is left. There's a little silicone over here for better grip. And one thing I did miss is I kind of wish that this came with like a, a strap or like a carabiner. That way I can just strap it on my backpack. Um, I can still attach a carabiner to this unit here, but still I'd rather have one just connect directly to the silicon or the speaker piece. Just to sum up the pros and cons, the audio quality is decent. It doesn't have that much of a bass. I do like how there's a solar charging option, but still I think the, the biggest feature to highlight to this is that I can use a micro SD card and not even have this pair with my Bluetooth device. Thanks for watching this review of the U-Moon Bluetooth speaker. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Walker Hamster. Bye.